Look how cute. She wasn't so sure about the hat when I put it on, but it looks so cute. Hey, baby. Isabella. Isabella, I love you. I think you're beautiful. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm super excited because I'm gonna take you through Isabella's bedside nursery and just kind of show you how I have everything organized and what we are currently using for our newborn. So I hope you find this video helpful and if you do, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also subscribe so you never miss any future videos from me. And without further ado, let's just jump right in. Really quick, I did want to share a postpartum update. I'm currently 19 days postpartum. Um, I should be clear to work out in about three weeks, which I'm so excited. But this is kind of where we're at. I still have a bump, but it just keeps going down every single day. And then once I start working out, I'll be back. I'm so excited. I just, I literally can't wait to just get back into a routine and I love the gym. If you know me, I'm obsessed. I'm actually a personal trainer, so I am missing it, needless to say. But let's kind of get into the video. I'll give you a quick little overview. This entire dresser used to be mine and my husband's but we kind of gave it to Isabella basically all our stuff is in these three drawers and then this one and this is Ugo's and this is mine um but yeah so this is kind of a quick overview of what we're working with and let me just start over here because we do have two bassinets currently so we have this super cute one that I had first and then we have the four moms. Basically right now I'm trying to figure out what type of bassinet she likes the best. Um, she's currently in the four moms and she's sleeping a lot longer so we might end up sticking with that. Um, I'm not sure if it will be hard to transition her into the crib but we'll deal with it when we get there. <laughs> so inside here I have my nursing pillow and then I just got this camera. I'm going to try it out and probably do a review on it. Um, but yeah, this was the bassinet that she was sleeping in. And then now we're over here and this just moves. It does has like a bunch of different movements, which she really likes. And then her swaddles are in here. We really love the Swaddle Me and the Halo swaddles. Um, as you can see, we have the muslin swaddles over here that we have never used like i highly recommend these and i will leave i will try to leave everything linked down below so down here basically i have her humidifier um and then her diaper pail we have the ubi uppy ubi i'll link it down below and then over here we have her hatch machine, which she loves it. She sleeps so well. And then the bottle of water for the humidifier. And then in here I just have her passies, passy clips, and then like teethers and stuff when she's going to need it. And then up here, this is where we change her. Um, I got this from... I will pop it up here on the screen because I cannot remember the name. Um, I think it was like Love Duo or, um, I can't remember. I'm super bad at names and I'm sleep deprived right now, but I will pop it up on the screen and link it down below. And then we just have these changing liners and then this little head shaping pillow that we can kind of just bring around wherever she's laying down. And then up right here, we have our diaper caddy. It's just a cute little basket with wipes, diapers, and then lotion, a baby brush, hand sanitizer, this little sucker that the hospital gave us. When she was born, she was getting like this thick saliva and she was like choking on it. So the hospital gave us that little sucker to kind of like suck the saliva out. 
to help her out. So um, I use that occasionally. And then I have this, these vitamin D drops because um, she did have jaundice and the a pediatrician recommended her taking that. And then I also have this little nose picker, which highly recommend. This is great to get the boogers out. And then up here, basically diapers, and then these are breast pads, reusable. And then we have all of her um, burp cloths, changing pad liners, bibs, um, and then in here we just have a bunch of miscellaneous stuff this is her nail file which i really love because i am so scared of cutting her nails then we have the frida nose sucker which i haven't used yet i've just been using the nose picker and then we have this um gas passer i haven't used it yet either um just a thermometer this i have used so i highly recommend having that for a newborn and then some other stuff when she's sick that we haven't used and haven't used that none of this medicine or anything we haven't used yet thank goodness um but before i use any of that i'm definitely going to talk to the pediatrician before i decide to use that so that's pretty much it in this drawer and then up here I have all of her clothes organized. So this is newborn, newborn, and then zero to three. She can fit in very few of the zero to three, but she's basically a newborn. And the sizings are crazy because some newborn is too big and then um, some of the zero to three fit. So it's, it's super weird. And then in here, I basically just threw in all these sleepers that are too big for her right now. And then, um, now that I'm looking at it, it doesn't look super organized, but whatever. These are all socks, and then this is hats and little mittens. So we have those. We have been using socks, we have been using hats and mittens um, like crazy. And then this is just stuff that, like leggings that are too big for her. And then down here, again, we have more outfits that are too big, and then I keep all of her swaddles down here. Um, and then the box for our owlet and another it's a halo sleep sack and then two carriers so i mean that's basically it that's all we use um we do have the uh snuggle me organic and she loves it we use it every single day um and then another thing that we use every single night is the owlet so I highly recommend the investment. I know there was like a bunch of mixed reviews on it. At least that's what I was told. But I decided to just go ahead and make the investment because literally the first few nights of having her, I slept not a wink. Like I literally went all night just like getting up for every single noise that I heard and I literally didn't sleep at all. Um, but after we got the outlet, I've actually been able to sleep. So it's just given me peace of mind. So I, if you're thinking about it, I highly recommend, like you can't go wrong, but that's pretty much everything we are using aside from like bath stuff. We have given her two baths actually. And, um, then we have like a bathtub and, um, washcloths, but I can do a newborn essentials video if that's wanted but that's pretty much what our setup looks like we have her very close to us which i really love and enjoy and i'm just so happy to have her and to be a mom and yeah i'm just super super excited and happy and i've like literally never felt this much love for someone so yeah i hope you guys liked the video i feel like it was super short but um, I hope you found it helpful. If you have any questions, leave them down below, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.